What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment, and you know what time it is. We're back in Wreckfest once again here, keeping up with the theme of the weekend, which is dirt racing of all kinds. And next up on the schedule is the main event. We are here at Bristol. It is covered in dirt, and we've got the NASCAR legends lined up and ready to go. We'll be driving as Joey Logano because he won this race when they did it last year. And we'll try to replicate that by getting the dub. And away we go. Or at least we're trying to. Spinning our wheels a whole lot off the line in this dirt. But getting away nonetheless here. Racing down into turn one. Where are they? Oh my god. I think I... Yep. I... Well. I see I may have left Pitball and Moon Gravity on from our last video. Take two in turn one is the problem solved. It appears to be. There we go. Everybody relax. We have rectified the issue, I'd say, as I'm getting bodied into the wall and flipped over into another pack of cars, which is a whole other problem in itself. Well done, everybody. What a flawless start. I might as well have just let pinball on for this. That went about as well. Honestly, I detected nearly no change at all. <laughs> we just we made it a little bit further into the corner. Look at the size of this pile. That's absurd. There aren't enough cameras in this stadium to try to capture all this carnage right here, so we'll do our best. Because everybody's just getting tipped, tossed, barrel rolled, bent, you name it. It's all happening here in turn one and two. Who would have thunk it? This is kind of a sad scene right here. He's going by Joey Logano while I'm in his car, and he's just totally immobilized. I'm about to run myself in the wall and take myself out, and I got people trying to roadblock me. Denny Hamlin, don't you ever try that on me, please. I have about two health points. I do not need this. Look at this junk pile up here with the clone Syndrix. How the hell did that happen? And everybody's wrecking. There you go. I just got the lead from this. This isn't exactly looking great. We are coming a halfway, but my car is refusing to steer. And I got Ricky on my ass. He just drives straight through me and us through the 24. Ricky, was that really necessary? I just hope these AI can sleep at night. Taking people out with two health points. That is ridiculous. And not being able to make it through turn one, not even one time. That's even more ridiculous. What is wrong with you buffoons? Chick Hicks, cobble a Chick Hicks car. Now that's fitting. And we're out of here. We got someone just doing donuts. Is that Priest? Yes, it is. We got Priest just doing donuts after the line. Don't pull a Mark Martin and think the race is over and start celebrating. This is not how this is. I got to thread the needle up here. No, there's no way that's happening. All right, see you later. Throw me down the apron, why don't you? There is no reason why that needed to happen. That was a little bit extra. And with that one car looking so good, I'm not even really that mad. Can I hit it from behind for some more TV time? No, I can't. I hit the wrong one car, and now I beached myself. Now, that's a hell of a job. We'll go ahead and crumple up the no reset challenge and throw that right out the window. That's gone. And I, of course, get hit by somebody and run into someone the second I phase back into reality. And here's Eric Almirola, the leader. You can just go ahead and go right to hell. Just go ahead and go away. I'm trying to... Why am I stuck? How am I stuck? I require some answers to this. All right, that physically did not make any sense. And that cost me, I was gonna say that cost me valuable time, but it really didn't because these guys are buffoons, they're idiots, they're morons, and they're doing the same thing. Eric Jones, get out of the way. I know this is Michigander on Michigander violence. I know I've been trying to stop this for too long, but I just can't, and I just got ass packed for the cause. So that's really grand right there. That really was for the cause. That was Brad Keselowski too. All right, well now somebody's gotta pay for this. I can't be the last one to get it now. I gotta evaluate this portion of the replay because this was such a ridiculous sequence of events. A little mini long one here and it started with that barrel roll that just didn't need to happen. None of us asked for it. But here we are, the receiver of it anyhow. And then the reverse job of a lifetime here to hit the one car and I hit the wrong one car and I just planted my ass up in the air on the bank. And further down the line here, the leader, Eric Almirola gets spotted and you know company policy around here. You see a shot to take down the leader, you take it. And we took it. We took damn near all of it. As it spells out in our Guide to Success handbook there. We even backed into him and took the ally hood with us. Get a good look at that ally car while you can. We might have something cooking up. Something a little bit new. Something a little fresh. And uh, let that distract you from this horrible scene that we're about to display here. Which is all of this Michigander violence here. Me, Eric Jones, and Brad Keselowski getting into a needless brawl. And then one more final shot to put Eric Jones away there. There are so many cars just KO'd and killed at the bottom of the track. Should I start counting right here? How about this? One, two, three, four, five, six. We got a damn roadblock up here. Seven, eight, nine. I don't even know. There was a bunch of them right there. There are millions of these idiots just bumbling around the bottom of the track with no sense of what to do. And a shot at the backstretch one final time here with just cars galore scattered. The roadblock's holding up, so I gotta stick to the wall, and I can't! It keeps throwing me away from it! 
It's throwing me into the car. That just jacked my car up for real. Now oh, no, my wheel. No, I am going to lose this race. No way. Eric Almirola is coming and I got to body him. If I can, I can't even hold it up on the banking. I promise you my car will not drive. No, come on. We're so close. Drive, you piece of trash. Come on. Don't know. Don't do this to me. What kind of karma is this? And there it is. There it is. Just kill me. I mean, that's really a heartbreaker right there. That is, I don't know why. Every now and then, Wreckfest, it drops one of those on you. And it's not a good feeling. Neither is AJ Allmendinger taking me out at the entrance of the corners. And everybody else once again piling up. Got to hit Recky on the way by. And we're actually getting through this with the greatest of ease. Here they come. We got to check this out with the static cam because it is a big one down here in the corners. Big trouble on the inside, and we barely make it around on the outside. We got popped a little bit there, but we kept on trucking, and now it's time to just observe the idiocy, right? It's like National Geographic. I say this every now and then, but it's for stupid race car drivers with no talent, skill, or ability. It's really a beautiful thing. Holy bumpolies, dude. How do we flatten this track out a little bit? Could you imagine this in real life? That would be insane. Can't even keep your wheels on the ground. We got Suarez over here in shambles in the Hamlin car. We got somebody's hood flying down the racetrack. We got Larson lining himself up for a pack here. Sorry about that, buddy, but get out the way. Oh my God, Suarez, where are you going, bro? How did that work out for you? Not too well, as we're just going right by everybody, and there's the leader wrecking out, and that hands it over to me. Thank you. And that makes it halfway, and we are the leader. Can we throw it away? Will we throw it away? Probably, but not as bad as Chris Busher just did. Oh my God, we're getting through all of this like days of thunder until I'm not. Till Kyle Larson's sticking out just enough. Thank you for that, bro. I actually appreciate that there's always one AI out there thinking about me and Carrie. Just to make one more trip through the junkyard really is all that's left to do at this point. Oh my God, Kurt Busch almost just claimed my soul right there. If he had left a second earlier, that could have been trouble. I would have been absolutely Molly Wobner. There's Tyler Ruddick. That, does that mean I just lapped second? That is going to be it. That is not just a dub. That is a dub by a full lap. These guys might be stupid. I can't even begin to understand what is really going on with the NASCAR legends lately, especially on the ovals. It seems like the oval AI are just chugging the idiot pills lately, and I do not understand why, and I do not know how to make it stop. I don't know how I've tried a couple of different mods even to improve the AI gameplay and performance, and uh, nothing really seems to do the work. But because that was over a little bit quickly, I'm not giving up on them just yet. What do you say we queue back up with those mods we had to turn off earlier? We'll go ahead and click those back on and give it a go, eh? I don't exactly expect this to yield phenomenal racing results here. They might be rather explosive results, but uh, well, we're gonna find out here shortly or right now as I am just flying through the corner on my head all the way through the corner section. We are all the way up the board. We're in the lead. We're in the lead. Flying through the air. I'm over the fence. I'm in the grandstands. I'm under the grandstands. I'm gonna be lining up for a beer and some popcorn. You know, it's gonna cost me $25,000 because we're at the racetrack. Someone check on me. I have been absolutely flattened to look at the state of my car. I can't even drive in this train line. I look like an animal of some kind. I got like the platypus effect going on. All this horribleness and then, oh, by the way, I'm in the lead because everybody else has just been annihilated and sent on a Space Force mission to the moon and beyond. Some of them can't even phase into reality right there. Well, that guy's going to phase into some fan's face probably. I'm sorry to whoever that Cindric car was. We, uh, yeah, he, his trajectory was not looking too good right there. That one definitely landed up in the sweets or something like that. Well, Marcus down as another halfway leader here. This might be, this might be a one and done race right here. And I was not sure which one we were going to get as I nearly got revenge on Almaning right there as the junkyard is once again laying here. But you never know if, I, if I'm able to just keep days of thundering my way through the field and avoiding the final destination scene that's unfolding right in front of my very eyes. Maybe we'll have a chance of success here. Oh, we got too many cars with too many different paths here. Oh, and we're going to slam one of the chick hicks. Couldn't think of a better guy to get in. He's not even, there's not even anybody in that car. That, that, oh, well, that's a good thing. Too bad there's someone in this car because that could not have felt good. Oh, chick hicks. What'd they do to you? We just have one more lap. If there was ever a lap that I wouldn't mind just being completely boring, this would be the one. But no, Ryan Blaney's got to go make a show of it. Good Lord, man. He's going on a ride. He just pulled up in a pit stall. Dude, he's going to get some service. He'll be right back in it. And that 
should do it chick hicks is gonna be the last sight we see here maybe we'll line ourselves up for a hit on whoever this poor soul is the kawiki car is gonna get crunched right at the end let's collect that second dub what a look for this car though at this angle it looks like some kind of jacked up like wagon el camino they they made some hot wheels or something and created this monster in that fat oh the one car went flying all the way to victory lane back there but he did not deserve it that is gonna do it ladies and gentlemen thank you all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it enjoy yourself some bristol dirt hit that like button subscribe and with that i'll see you in the next one peace